Hi everyone, this is Du, and in this video, we're going to talk about the Google Authenticator app. The app adds in two-step verification for any service that has the option for Authenticator apps. This is a more safe alternative to text message two-step verifications because it's much more difficult for hackers to break into and it'll keep all of your two-step verification systems in one app. So let's take a look. When you first open the app, you have the option for scanning a barcode or manually entering one. Most websites, app developers, software systems have the option to add in a two-step verification via an Authenticator app. So we're going to use Facebook as an example. I'm going to go to Settings and Privacy, which most developers will have a section for. I'm going to click on Settings and then go to Security and Login. It's very similar amongst these systems. What I'm going to do now is scroll down until I see Use Two-Factor Authentication, which is another name for Two-Step Authenticator. Um, here there's an authenticator app, so use that authenticator app button right there and it's going to generate a QR code for me. I just have to pull out my Google Authenticator app, click the camera, and scan the QR code right there and I'll add it right to my authenticator app. Now what I need to do to connect my Facebook to my authenticator app is to type in that code that generates every 60 seconds. So it's really safe because it'll generate every 60 seconds, it won't be the same code ever. So I'm gonna type in that code to finish my connection and set up two-factor authentication before it refreshes. And now that's all set, it's on, and every time I log in, I will have to do this extra step where I open my Authenticator app and type in a six-digit code that it has generated for me to be able to finish the login. Now this is gonna be, it'll look a little bit different as far as how you log in on other sites but generally it's the same type of step. You'll have to set up a two-factor authentication or two-step verification. It, it, it will be one of those two names, and then you connect your account to the Google Authenticator app in the same process, and it'll generate a code for you every 60 seconds. And then you'll have to have an extra step when you log in each time, making your accounts much safer.